Good afternoon everyone. It is Tuesday, just about 12.30 in the afternoon and as you can see I'm boiling some water. I'm going to be making some iced tea out of my Lipton bags. This is something my mom used to do when we were kids and I loved it. So I'm going to be doing that today. So welcome to a new day. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Karina and thank you all so much for tuning in. Alright guys, so I'm going to pour my hot water into the pitcher I got from the Dollar Tree. And I have another pitcher in the, so I bought a total of two. And I have another one in the refrigerator with all with water, which I'm going to fill up my cup with some ice water. Um, the reason I'm trying to put different drinks in the fridge is we're trying to cut down on our soda intake. So uh, for just not drinking so much soda and for cost wise. So... All right, so with this being from the Dollar Tree, I'm hoping the hot water is not going to melt it. I'm not going to fill it up all the way. Not sure how it's going to turn out. I haven't done anything like this in a long time with Lipton tea. Oh, perfect. Alright, so that filled it up halfway and I took three Lipton tea bags and I'm just going to put them in here. That other little noise is the fan I got over here. It's a little bit cooler today. Uh, I think the high is only going to be 86 today. But the uh, humidity and dew point are probably going to be a little higher. So you can see how the tea bags are working already. So we're just going to leave those tea bags in there for a little bit and then when it cools off a little more I'm going to fill it up with water and then add some sugar. Like I said my mom used to make this for us when we were kids and I loved it back then and I've only made it like since I've been here in Wisconsin I only made it once or twice when we lived in our other place before we bought this house. Glenn doesn't really care for it um, but I don't know let's see if I like it again and if so I'll continue to make this kind of tea maybe I'll buy some other tea for Glenn and uh, so yeah I don't know it kind of brings back some memories I, I can't wait to taste it yeah I used to when I was a kid a teenager rather well that's still a kid but when I was a teenager I, I loved to listen to music. Me and my brother used to listen to music all the time and record on our cassette tapes and everything. And I used to sit in my room with the door closed just listening to uh, albums. And And she used to bring me tea because she knew I just liked to sit in there and listen to music. But she always brought me tea or, you know, she would make me pizza and bread. And, you know, she was awesome. Miss my mom so much. And my dad. So, but those are the memories they leave you with and that's, that's what gets me through. I usually like to put three nice ice cubes in my uh, cup. Now I'll fill it with some ice water instead of soda. And these cups, uh, they're thermo or insulated. We got these some um, couple years ago. This is from Mossy Oak. We got them at Fleet Farm. Glenn has a green one. Um, and these keep our drinks cold for a very long time. So that's why we use these cups. Okay, so I have my uh, pitcher of tea. Um, I don't know if you could see in the camera, but it's still steaming a little. So I'm going to let that cool off a little before I add water and sugar. And then over here, I got a sink full of soapy water. I have the burner plates soaking in there because I'm going to clean the stove today. Right now, I'm going to cut us a piece of pie. And I'm going to eat the pie, fill up bird feeders, and then I'll come back in and do the tea and clean the stove. All right, so we're going to enjoy a piece of pie. This is Glenn's piece. All right, so stay tuned for what's next. All right, everyone, so 
tea is cooled off, I'm going to go ahead and try to make this thing. Well, not try, I am going to. <laughs> uh, I've been outside, and Glenn's been tinkering with his uh, wheelchair, cleaning it up, and stuff like that. And I got the bird cam back up. I fixed another box for it. So the bird cam is back up, and I have it on slow motion. So hoping to get good footage of birds flying in real slow so you can see their wings flapping. So I'm pretty excited about that. All right, and I got some water out for the birds, so let's get this tea done. I'm gonna get some water in this. All right, so I am gonna throw some sugar in here, but first I'm gonna turn off the fan, otherwise I'll have sugar in my face. So, all right. Not sure how much to put in. I'm gonna start off with just a half a cup. Start off, I'm gonna try that half a cup. All right, so I'm gonna continue to stir this and I think I'm gonna pour it in a cup to taste it and I will be right back. All right, so I think it tastes pretty good. So I got a couple of ice cubes in here, and Coca-Cola glass. My mom used to love Coca-Cola. Yeah, when we were growing up, she, she liked everything Coca-Cola. But that's uh, not why we got these glasses. Uh, Glenn's sister used to go to Goodwill all the time, and she knew I liked Coca-Cola, so she used to pick up every Coca-Cola thing she could find, and she used to bring it to us, so uh, she was a good-hearted person. All right. I didn't pour it in my uh, in this cup because I just poured a bunch of water in there, but that'll stay good like all day long. So let me taste this. I love it. Tastes like my mom used to make it. I love it. Absolutely love it. So I may have found my new main drink <laughs> besides water. <laughs> so yeah, that's good. I love it. Tastes really good. All right, so I'm gonna clean up this little mess. Uh, put this in the refrigerator. It's not really cold right now, but that's okay. Um, next thing I gotta do is clean the stove. And uh, what I forgot to show you guys yesterday is I showed you a quick glimpse of the freezer, uh, the foods all in front of it, but I have actually two little baskets from the Dollar Tree in there. And uh, I think I'll just show you that quick, okay? All right, everyone, so I just wanted to show you quick the shredded mozzarella. I have two baskets in here from the Dollar Tree. One basket, this one right here has like brats, hot dogs, sausage, anything, any food like that. And then over here I have the sliced ham that I cut up from the tube ham. And oh, what else do I have in there? I already forgot. Oh, this is the, the pie crust. Oh, the chorizo, anything of breakfast type meat, I have in there. So, and this plastic bag is just to fill with ice. So when this is finished freezing all the way, I'll put some ice in here and then fill it up again. So I always have a rotation of ice there. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you that. All right.
All right, everyone, so I got to get supper started. Um, I'm done cleaning the stove and the sink, so I'm going to get supper started right now. It is that time, and this is going to take a few hours, so I need to get this in the oven, and then I got to go to the store because the uh, fur babies are pretty much out of uh, canned food, so I got to go get some of that. Um, what's for supper, as you can see right in front of you? This is the half slab of ribs I was talking about. Uh, when I when we purchased this, it was like a whole slab, and then I just cooked the other half at that time, and this is the other half. So I just got some salt, uh, seasoned salt, pepper, onion powder on both sides, and then I'm going to go ahead and throw that in the oven, and I'm going to get some baked potatoes in the oven. With it, we'll probably have a veggie, like corn or something, canned corn, and then I took the broth broccoli florets out of the freezer and I think I just might steam those and have those with it. All right so I'm going to get this in the oven and stay tuned. All right everyone it is supper time and here is supper. We got some barbecue ribs and yes that's all I eat and we got some baked potato, canned corn, we got some broccoli that I took it out of the freezer. So I already got some stuff outside in the garage, which is where we're eating. Glenn will most likely put sour cream and butter on his potato. I usually put butter and cheese. So that's what we're having. So stay tuned for whatever happens next.